All right. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to cook up some damper in the bush. But first, we got to start the fire. All right, so we'll get the newspaper out. Whoa! Let's cook up this damper. So, first ingredient to cook up this damper, self-raising flour. Second ingredient, some beer. Third ingredient will be some rosemary straight from the garden. Oh, it smells amazing. And then fourth ingredient, some salt. So that's the ingredients. And now let's, uh, let's mix it up. So, get my knife. There we go. So we'll just pour some flour into the bowl. Um, I reckon that will do. And then we'll chuck in some salt. And then I'm just gonna do some chopping. I don't really think I need to use it all. So we'll start off with that. We'll just mix that up with our clean hands. Probably could have added a bit more rosemary, but it doesn't really matter. And then, the beer. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, no, that's all right. Yep, we'll be needing a bit more. It tastes horrible. And now the reason why we put that beer in is because of the yeast. That will um, help it rise when it goes into the coals. So it goes all nice and fluffy. All right. There we go. That's what the, um, the dough should uh, look like before you um, put it in the coals. Smells good. Smells really, really good. Man, that's hot. That's a good spot right there. Okay, since this fire is like ah, oh, um, since this fire is way too hot, like I can barely stay right here. I'm just gonna wait a bit because if I put the damper in when the coals are too hot, then it'll just burn and yeah, it'll be a disaster. So um, I'm gonna be patient. I'm gonna wait until the uh, coals cool a bit. And, um, yeah. It is time to whack this damper in. All right. So now, we plop the damper in, just like that, and then we bury it, right in the coals. Nice. That is looking pretty good. And now we just wait, maybe, I don't know, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 minutes, and um, yeah, we'll dig in. Oh yeah, that's how it's done. I'm tempted to check it. It's been like 15 minutes and um, you know, I'm not too sure if it's ready or not, but I reckon it's worth a check. So I'm just gonna scrape these, oh, it's right there, look at it. Wow, it's risen. Yeah, it's definitely risen. That's awesome. And I've heard if you give it a flick, and it sounds hollow, it's ready, and that does not sound hollow. So let's bury it back up and wait another 15 minutes. You know what, guys? I think it's been cooking for like 30 minutes, so it's gotta be done now. So let's pop her out and have a look. All right, it's pretty hot. Here we go. Yum. It's a bit uh, charcoal-y. But you can just dust it off like this.
Okay, there's the damper. Awesome. All right, what do you reckon? Cut her open and see how it looks. It smells amazing, the rosemary. You can just, oh. All right, here goes. It's probably gonna be wet dough. Yep, it's wet dough. Oh, nah. On the outsides, it's good. Whoa. Ugh. Yeah, that's certainly not ready. Wow. <laughs> I'm so retarded. Oh, yum. Look at that. Just ignore this bit here. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna chuck some butter on. So there it is. Mm. Tastes a lot like charcoal. But, um, you know what? The bits that actually got cooked, like all the outside of the damper got cooked, and it tastes amazing. The beer, the rosemary, the butter. Oh, it's just really good. Really, really good. Yum. And there we have it, guys. That is how you make damper in the coals, in the bush. Tastes amazing, looks horrible. But uh, yeah, next time we would have cooked it for maybe five, five or ten minutes more. Have a good one, guys, and uh, I'll see you next time. Over and out.